to another episode of Human versus Something Else. Today, going up against the human, we have the coronavirus. So, Roni, how are you feeling about all of this? I have been gearing up for this moment my whole life. I am passionate about making life awful for humans and generally being a bad guy. So, you know, I'm ready to go viral. I already infected some kids to dude in a beanie. And let me tell you, it's my mission to infect so many more. <laughs> Let's get straight to it. Different viruses can be transmitted or spread in different ways. Some viruses, like hepatitis, can spread through sharing infected food or drink, though many can be spread through breathing in an infected person's sneeze. <coughs> All right, Ronnie, what's your strategy? Well, I'm going to see if I can jump from person to person through coughing and sneezing. Here I go. Like you really fell down there. I have another strategy. Jump onto his phone and then wait for someone else to touch that phone and then wait for that person to touch their face and then boom! Infection. Back in round two then. On average, people touch their faces up to 23 times every hour. Touching your face with infected hands can be one common way to get that virus in you. You didn't see the old hand washing coming. It's the oldest trick in the book. But I, I've been practicing my, my jumping, so I'll just jump really far. It's thought that coronavirus can jump from person to person. Of course, the more distance between you and another person, the further the virus has to jump. And the less time you spend with one person, the less time the virus has to make that jump. No offence, but you're not very good at this being a bad guy and taking over the world thing. Surely people are bound to start hanging out close enough soon, sharing drinks, socialising at birthday parties. Dude, can you just go away? You're so annoying. <laughs> right. Sorry, man. <gasps> no! And if you're not careful, I'll develop a vaccine, and then you'll really be in for it. <laughs> 